Hello and welcome to my Halloween special. Today, my little friend here and I are going to find out if we can produce biochar inside a pumpkin. Yes, biochar inside a pumpkin. <laughs> I'm very sorry. Um, so my plan is to fill the pumpkin with wood, a little fire, and basically see how it goes from there. If it gets too scary, and I'm prepared to put the fire out. This is a completely regular pumpkin. The only thing I did is that I drilled in several holes in the bottom to get enough oxygen in to keep the fire burning. I'm very excited. I hope you are too. Let's find out. Well, that was scarier than I thought, but also more successful. We actually made some decent biochar. Now my friend is a little bit grumpy, but who can blame him? Come here. I think he did a great job and the trick where he came back from the dead. Amazing. So here's what I think happened. Pumpkins consist of 90% water. The water vapor drove out the oxygen and extinguished the fire. When I opened the lid, the water vapor came out and new oxygen relit the fire. Now, why is the pumpkin still intact? Inside, it's all black and charred, but on the outside, it almost looks like nothing happened. The reason is that water is a poor heat conductor. I was able to touch the pumpkin at the end and it felt only lukewarm. So is it safe to produce biochar inside a pumpkin? Probably not. So don't do this at home and leave it to professionals like us. I think I will now have a nice pumpkin soup. Thanks for watching and happy Halloween.